Welcome viewers, this is Green Gaia Tarot and this is your Earth Sign Taurus Virgo Capricorn next 7 days energy guidance messages reading. So we will start the reading with the Taurus. Welcome Taurus, this is your next 7 days energy guidance messages reading. Let's start the reading with the Tarot. Then we will follow your Oracle cards. Taurus, your first card is Nine of Pentacles. Next, you have the Fool card, the Major Arcana. Next, you have the Eight of Wands. Then, you have the Sun card, the Major Arcana. Next, you have the Five of Wands. Okay. Taurus, this is going to be a very interesting and blessed week for you. The first card is the Nine of Pentacles. So you are very abundant, empowered, stable, wise in this week. Things are definitely looking good for you. The next card is the Fool, the Major Arcana that indicates that you are venturing out and probably you are traveling also. That can definitely be for work or for some time off. And you are moving forward with new adventures, new projects, new work situation. You are trying things differently. The next card is the Eight of Wands. This is the card that tells about fast communication. There might be some messages or some information coming your way that will be helpful for you. This can definitely also indicate your spiritual awakening of some sort. The next card is the Sun card, the Major Arcana that is the ultimate blessings and abundance and prosperity. There will be new projects, new beginning happening for you. And for some of you at least, that is the indication of a childbirth. The final card for you is the Five of Wands. This is the card that tells about the difference of, of sorry, difference of opinion and conflict happening in your surroundings there might be some negative people who won't understand your vision and views and that can lead to conflicts also so be mindful of that these are the people who might not be happy with your progress and your prosperity so you need to stay alert and definitely clear in your energies to handle the situation well. So Taurus, this was your tarot. Let's see what we have for you in the Oracle cards. You have strategy. So you need to definitely plan ahead and plan foolproof how to manage the wealth, the time and keeping records or going through records will help you for sure. You need to be mindful about keys. You might misplace or lose keys. That was the message that I got suddenly for you, Taurus. Be mindful of that. The next card for you is Embrace the In-Between, Flamingo Spirit. This is the card that is telling me that definitely you are in a process of some sort where you are waiting for results after hard work this is a change of situation that is happening clo happening closely or better say it is happening now and you need to definitely enjoy the in between because if you are anxious about the future or you want to things happen faster that won't help you being anxious won't help you you need to just mind the daily progress and enjoy your life it will happen completely when it meant to the final card for you is the helpful people so there will be people who are going to help you if you need don't hesitate to ask and 
if there is a conflict happening there you also can ask for help from others or suggestions and some sort of support and you will be helped so taurus this was your next seven days energy guidance messages reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great week ahead welcome virgo this is your next seven days energy guidance messages reading let's start the reading with the tarot then we will follow your oracle cards Virgo, your first card is Eight of Cups. Next, you have the Empress, the Major Arcana. Next, you have the Five of Swords. Then, you have the Devil card, the Major Arcana, that we don't like to see much. Then, we have the Six of Cups. And the final and the extra card for you is the Eight of Pentacles. So, Virgo, right away I can tell you this is a week that is very important for you. As the week begins, you changing your path. There was something that wasn't serving you anymore and you are cutting cords with it. You are changing your path towards your better future. This is a strong and determined decision that you are taking and you are making things happening for you. Because the very next card to the Eight of Cups is the Empress card. So this change of scenarios or change of situation will definitely be prosperous and helpful for you there will be abundance there will be new beginnings new path for some of you that is also a, an indication of a childbirth and this is something that is going to be very fruitful in your future the next card is the five of swords this is the card that is telling me that you are on the right path and though the people around you might not understand your path your values and views they are not going to stop you the very next card to the five of swords is the devil card this is the card that is telling me with your five of swords energy you must not hurt anyone by your words be mindful of your words you can see in this image the people that are moving away, one of them is crying and that person is upset clearly. So this is the energy that I think you need to be mindful of. You are right, but it is not always about being right. Yes, you are right and it is your path. You can move forward, but... Be mindful of your words. You must not hurt anyone. Try to make them understand. If they don't understand, don't push them too hard or try to make them understand too hard that, <coughs> pardon me, they feel upset around you. So that is the energy that I'm getting. The next card is the Six of Cups. So definitely in this path that you are taking, you are going to find a second chance in life. This can definitely be someone coming from your past and you finally being happy with them or this is something that was lost, you thought and now it is here so you are happy this can definitely be a work situation also a love situation can definitely be this energy too the next card is the eight of pentacles this is the card that is telling me you are going to be very busy in this new journey of yours or new situation of yours because you want to build your future strong and beautiful and that's why you are definitely going to be really busy so virgo this was your 
tarot. Let's see what your oracles have for you. You've got the yin and yang card. This is the card of you finding the right balance. Again, the devil card was there. So that was the card of imbalance and you are recommended to find the right balance. This yin and yang card is also giving me the union energy that was the six of cups. Someone coming into your life. Someone coming back from your past and that is the union that can definitely happen for you. So that is also good. Let's see what we have for you in the next card. Take the lead. Stack spirit. This is a card that is telling you to definitely move forward. Lead others. If you need to make the move, definitely make the move. Because waiting is not something that is recommended at this point of time. It is now or never. You need to definitely move forward, Virgo. Your next card is Remain Positive. This is the card that is telling me that you need to be positive and always concentrate or focus on the brighter side of things. Yes, there are things that are not so bright and that are a bit difficult also. But if you focus on the difficulties more, you won't see yourself going anywhere. You need to definitely see past the difficulties and the beautiful result will help you to proceed forward through the difficulties. So Virgo, this was your next 7 days energy guidance messages reading. If you like my reading, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share, subscribe and comment. Thank you very much for your participation. Have a great week. Welcome Capricorn, this is your next 7 days energy guidance messages reading. Let's start the reading with the tarot, then we will follow your oracle cards. Your first card is the judgment. Next you have the ace of cups. Then you have the hermit. Next you have the emperor. Then you have the five of cups. Okay, Capricorn, definitely a very important week as you've got some very interesting major arcanas. The first card is the judgment card. That is the major arcana that is telling me that this is a week when you are going to definitely find something big coming your way that you have been working hard for. It is something that is going to change your life big time and this is the judgment for your good karma the next card is the ace of cups so definitely there will be new openings new opportunities heading your way in your creative world in your love life also is an indication there might be many doors opening for you at this point of time that can give you the satisfaction regarding your job situations also the next card is the hermit card this is the card that tells me you are very much willing to learn more and this can definitely be regarding your work or any kind of creative project you are moving forward with learning and growing procedure to definitely achieve better results this can definitely also indicate you looking forward towards some spiritual learning to grow spiritually also. The next card is the Emperor. This is the card that tells me you finding the right strength, knowledge and abilities to conquer every obstacle that comes your way. You are definitely financially very stable. And your mental strength is something that is going to give you the center stage. You are going to lead people, inspire people also. The final card for you is the Five of Cups. This is the card that is telling me to warn you about the imbalance in your energy. You are lingering into some past loss. 
you have it all in this week still you are not healed from the past and you are not happy with the present that is the two of cups you need to definitely be thankful for this two of cups that you have and enjoy it live life and enjoy life practice gratitude don't stay stuck in the past it is already gone if there was some kind of learning you have learned it now move on heal yourself so capricorn this was your tarot for the week let's see what we have for you in the oracles you've got the happy family card so definitely there will be good times with family and friends joyful times and togetherness is brightly indicated the next card is the butterfly spirit transformation is beautiful so there will be some sort of transformation or change happening in your life that you need to embrace and resisting that won't help you so definitely move forward with it the final card for you is you are ready so you don't need to worry about the transformation the growth the progress things are really looking good for you in this week capricorn so capricorn this was your next 7 days energy guidance messages reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great week ahead so viewers this was your earth sign taurus virgo capricorn next 7 days energy guidance messages reading If you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great week ahead